Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. And here we have Paris Saint-Germain against Montpellier. I'm Peter Drury and it's my chance to say that it is an absolute delight to have Jim Beglin beside me. Hi Peter, always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. Paris Saint-Germain shape up in a 4-3-3. Well, it's a system that promotes width, Peter. The wide men can stretch the fences and just create that running room for others. Verratti Cavani played out to the right he's got away lovely little display of skill that is so what's he planning here? Shoots! It's bounced out! They've scored! There is the breakthrough! Cessignon duly reaps his reward, kept his call cool whilst the defence lost their bearings. Our players like this fella almost have a sixth sense to get themselves in such great coaching positions. How quick-minded was that? Montpellier have an early lead. Good start. Neymar. It's Cavani. Trout, he's gone for it! Gorgeous from Cavani! Well, it certainly livened things up a bit, and that next goal now is absolutely crucial. Oh, look, it's always great to see a solo effort with a goal. It's the ideal combination of pace and control. Paris Saint-Germain with the equaliser, and we're all square. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you'll take back again. Balls come loose and the chase is on. He's left his man. Sessignon. Sessignon. Now it's Cavani. And now they can launch a counter. Cavani spreads it towards the left. Neymar. Good delivery, no joy. I have to commend the wing play, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Now it's Neymar. Forward it goes. Neymar is on the back foot. Going through. Hits one! He is off the hook. Much personal relief. Out wide to the right. Kozawa 
gets it back. And the first half is done. Genuinely interesting game here. Very, very watchable. Two goals, one each. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Dressing room after a half in which we've seen two goals, one each. And the game right on edge. Already up and running for the second half. No changes at the interval from either side. Last day. He's left his man. Great run this. He's covered quite a distance. Played into the middle. It's Sessignor! Good stop. That wasn't easy. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. immediate danger Sessignon he's got away plenty waiting in the middle Cavani displaying his defensive capabilities there that's no strikers tackle well they say that your front lads should be that first line of, uh, of stopping the opposition has a pop comes as a mighty relief. He's caught him there, it's a free kick. Saint-Germain chosen to bring on the last of their substitutes. Avani looking as though he's being given special treatment here. Treatment he could well do without. Well, his stealth has been caught. Great leap! Goal! Paris Saint-Germain! They've done it! It was coming! They have their reward! An absolute gem of a cross. It made the header simple. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Paris Saint-Germain get themselves into the lead. Yeah, they deserve great credit for turning things around, but they'll now need the defensive resilience to equal that attack in flair. Sessignon. Got away with one there. Thiago Motta can take all the credit for reading the situation, but careless defence played its part. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Going 
coming through. Aimed in towards the centre. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Di Maria, a real chance to break. It's come loose. Paris Saint-Germain just have to run down the clock. Well, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation. And it needs to be any time now, really. The final whistle. Paris Saint-Germain have done it in dramatic fashion. A massive test of character and they passed it with flying colours. A truly outstanding comeback by any measure. How would you summarise what we've seen?